Does anyone know why movie film is 24 frames per second? You know, fool know. Tell us, Mr. Audio. In 1879, Scottish photographer Edward Muybridge invented the Zoopraxiscope, which could animate a series of about a dozen still pictures. He asked Thomas Edison to work with him to combine the moving pictures with Edison's phonograph to have a total audio-video experience. Edison instead tasked William Dixon to see if there was a better way to make moving pictures. Dixon rejected the Zoopraxiscope concept since it only worked for a very short loop of pictures. Instead, he looked at the celluloid film that was recently invented by Hannibal Goodwin. Dixon suggested that the film could be in a long strip 35 millimeters wide with sprocket holes on each side so that gears could better move the film. This would allow a much longer sequence of images to be animated. Dixon suggested a frame rate of 40 frames per second. However, early film cameras were not motorized but were actually hand cranked by the operator, which caused the film speed to vary. Most of the silent films were in the 16 frame per second range. In 1926, Warner Brothers introduced the Vitaphone system, developed by Western Electric, the company that invented electrical recording a year earlier. Warner Brothers' first feature with Vitaphone was Don Juan, which had music and sound effects, but no dialogue. Vitaphone was double system, and the sound was played from a synchronized 33 and a third RPM 16-inch shellac phonograph disc. It was at that time that film speed was standardized at 24 frames per second where it remains to this day. Thanks, Mr. Audio. For more interesting facts about sound, visit Mr. Audio at soundimages.com.